All right, guys, it's Casey's Nation here again. Uh, so, uh, I'm kind of going along the lines that uh, Mondays might be a product review day or whatnot or uh, something. I'll try to at least upload a video every Monday. If not, uh, I'll try to let you know. But anyways, today I figured I'd show you something I picked up pretty recently. I uh, was just doing some shopping and uh, found this item marked down in the clearance aisle, which is surprising but uh basically what i have here is a mini mag light i found it at Wal local walmart so uh well not i got it for like five bucks i know they go for eight dollars regularly though but uh five bucks for a mag light was a deal uh it's an old school type mag light with uh just a regular incandescent bulb but uh anyways this is it uh i've already opened it and whatnot i just wanted to show you what it looks like in the package so uh Basically, it's the mini mag light. Uh, it's the two double A bat, uh, two double A version. Uh, it has fourteen lumens. Uh, it has a about. It's approximately a fifteen hour and fifteen minute uh, continuous. Uh, I guess shine or whatnot. You can't see it, but it's all on this little thing right here. It says fifteen hours and fifteen minutes. And I guess that's how long it'll continuously shine. Um, it has a one meter reflectance thing. I guess it's waterproof because there's some little clouds here with some rain. Uh, and it has a 96 meter uh, um, distance this can go, supposedly. Um, but uh, that really doesn't mean a lot. What you get on the back is a couple, little bit of instructions on the inside. Uh, it's just more... A lot of a lot of it's like maintenance and uh, inspection stuff. Some interesting stuff to read if you're a little bored. And uh, warranty stuff. There's also a complete breakdown of the flashlight, which a lot of things don't have nowadays. There's complete breakdowns of items, and that's pretty neat. Um, which uh, which is also pretty cool is that these are made in America. They're not made uh, somewhere in like Japan or China somewhere that's cheap. I know. Uh, things nowadays just about everything's made over there and it's kind of great to find something uh, homemade I guess or uh, within the state made but anyways basically you get the flashlight which is pretty cool they ran out of the black but they come in various colors they even have a camo one um, they have a di they have a digital camo they have this one they have a blue one and they have a red one and then they have the, the basic black and they were out of the black so I got the blue but uh it shines pretty bright um and I kind of like it a lot better than these new little stubby flashlights that have come around that are no bigger than three inches and run off of triple A's um mainly because this has a telescoping feature and I can see pretty freaking far with this compared to one of those little ninja type little stubby flashlights i call them stubs but you get the flashlight which is pretty cool it runs off of two AA batteries uh it also has a candlelight feature if you didn't know uh basically that's what they were trying to tell you on the uh the back of the package here is that you can take the top off and sit it on the top and then sit it and if you I'll turn the lights out you can use it as candlelight or whatnot it's kind of an interesting pe feature to the flashlight that's pretty much it um and it, as i said it has a telescoping lens you can make it go big or small or you can really get it real big if you <laughs> almost have the cap completely off of it um it's real durable uh if you don't believe me go online and watch people just ha like half the time destroy these they last up to like 10 minutes and fire pits they they run over they drop people drop huge rocks on them uh if you don't believe that these are almost uh very or not indestructible because nothing really is indestructible but um if you don't believe that this is a very durable flashlight go online uh find some videos of it uh, and uh prove yourself wrong because these things can go through hell and still work and uh, actually there's also a uh, portion on the Maglite flashlight website that has just stories people have written um, that these things have gone through. Um, but basically, you get the flashlight, you get two extra bulbs, which is kind of cool. So uh, you get a total out of this whole set of four bulbs. You get a bulb 
uh, installed in the flashlight. And then you also get a bulb in the uh, the rear of the flashlight, the cap of it, like all mag lights are uh, known for. And then you get this nice little pouch thingy where you can you can put your little flashlight in and put it on your belt loop if you don't. I don't really use these. These this it's uh it's just something extra to have with it. I use a little thing I made uh, a little while back. It was just a little toolkit flashlight thing. Clips on my belt and whatnot. Holds a knife. But uh, that's it. So this has been Casey's Nation for another product review. Uh, it's the Mini Mag Light. I don't know if you can see it, but it says it's made in California. There you go. You can see Mini Mag Light right there. And it says uh, the AA Mag Instrument California USA. It says USA right there. So, uh, anyways, I'm rambling. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and uh, thanks for uh, stopping by. Oh, by the way, I will do. Uh, I'm doing planning on doing a flashlight video and all my flashlights and whatnot, what I think is good and not. So, just look forward to that. So, uh, uh, see you later.